Hello, I'm Sharon Cuppet, Executive Vice President of Marketing at YX. We created a category called Cell Phone Signal Boosters and um, almost entirely through a PR campaign. So I have to say that, and we won um, national PR awards. And so I have to say that was very proud because we were up against people like Kibitz and the national launch of iPod. So it was very exciting. There's no magic uh, key to marketing. It's a lot of trial and experiments. And it's nice to be able to share that among other marketers. Uh, I always think the toughest decision is, um, is having to help people find a new career path. Um, let's compare it to American Idol. You see those singers out there and sometimes they just cannot sing. And they're saying everyone tells them they're the best singer. And I'm hoping that I'm more like Paula in telling them, oh, you need to tr find a new marketing, you need to find a new career, versus Simon. <laughs> so, but, that's, uh, but it's the hardest thing to tell somebody who really wants to be in a position that it's just not going to happen. I'm Kevin Kowalski and I am the Senior Vice President of Worldwide Brand Management for Crown Plaza Hotels and Resorts. I do think that businesses are successful or not based on how well they understand their customers and how much value they deliver to their customers and that's what we do as, as branders and marketers. You know, We try to figure out who are our most important customers, what are their needs and values and then how can we deliver the most value to them. Um, and if we do that and do it well, you know, there's no question that our business will be successful. People have a real passion for this business that are in it. I go into a hotel and, and meet the staff, and I know within 15 seconds if that person is a lifelong hotelier or they're not. It's incredibly motivating and cool to learn about people around the world and cultural nuances and where they're different, but also how they're the same. My name is Bill Watkins, and I'm the co-owner of the Morena Group. So our goal was to come into this business to help people, help our employees, um, help our customers, uh, help our uh, vendors somehow. And to do that, we had to clearly uh, give a message that uh, would resonate, particularly with our customers, because they were the ones that were gonna, going to purchase our product. And so, to be the leader, what we had to do was we had to solicit participation from everyone who was kind of contributing into our pot and kind of stirring it with us, but it had to be a very clear recipe. It, it was a little bit of this and it was a little bit of that, but the recipe, we knew exactly where we were going to take this, what message we were going to take, right or wrong, we didn't know at that particular time, and we've not changed that message. I hate to say this because it sounds cliche, but it's just flattering even to be a finalist, and it really is. AMA is a great organization. I've always uh, uh, admired it. It has great education programs, and to be recognized by your peers and by AMA is a big deal. So I'd be very happy, and as I said, I'm just flattered to be a finalist.